Hello, hello, hi, how are you? Uh, this is your friend and your brother, Apostle Eric Chibango, Divine from Divine Royalty Embassy. Thank you. Uh, it's good to have me again. Thank you for giving me this time even to listen to me. Thank you so very much. Um, if you have followed uh, from the time I started on this topic, you will discover that God has been speaking to us in a very marvelous way. Today, I am laid uh, again so that we can understand really what this topic is all about. When you know yourself, you know God. Knowing yourself is knowing God. You cannot say, I love my brother or I love myself and yet you hurt your neighbor. So you must understand that the fact that you are created in the image of God, that doesn't make you independent from other human beings. So even the person that you hate most, God can still use them to be a blessing to you. So you must understand that we are all co-workers in the vineyard of God. The fact that you're not a pastor like me, that doesn't mean you're not important. The body has many parts, but yet uh, it functions in unison. It functions in love. You discover that when you're walking, you hit yourself on a stone. The hands will rush there and the mouth will rush to cry in pain. So you must understand that God created you and I so that we can be his representative. Now, representatives to who? To other gods who are created in his image. So if he created you, he also created me. So there is something that you have that I don't have. And there is something that you have that you must understand that I don't have and something that I have that you don't have. So we all need each, each other in unison. So the fact that you are the mouth, that doesn't make me less important because I'm the ear. Maybe because you talk and somebody doesn't talk, that doesn't make them less of being a human being. So God created us having a plan and the papers for you and I. The Bible says, who shall I send? Who will go before us? Who will represent me? You know, so you are a representative of God because God calls us his ambassadors. An ambassador is a person that is in a country from another country. He's a representative of a country in another country. So you must understand that you are an ambassador that is coming from the kingdom of God to represent the kingdom. The one that came in the name of Jesus, he came and he said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. He came to show us how an ambassador of heaven lives. Maybe you've been living as an ambassador of America, as an ambassador of Zambia, but I want you to know, above all these offices that we carry, we are an ambassador of Christ. Right in that office where you are, you must be able to preach Christ. You don't need to carry a pulpit everywhere, but you must carry Christ in you. Because God created you and I that we might worship him. So so even in that business that you are doing, it is to worship God. Is that business worshiping God? Is that career worshiping God? Is God involved in the relationship that you are in? Because when God was created you, he had himself in his mind. So whatever that you're doing, don't think God doesn't want you to have business. Don't think God doesn't want you to have a job. Whatever that you want to have is because God had put it in you. Of course, not about these negative things. I'm talking about positive things that will bring the glory of the Father. So today I just felt that I should share with you and I that God loves us and he wants us to represent him as he is. He needs you and I to multiply himself here on earth. Thank you so very much. This has been your friend, your brother, Apostle Eric Chivango Divine from Divine Royalty Embassy. Thank you for your time. God bless you. Shalom, shalom.